Hello everyone, it's another beautiful blessed day today to always be in the presence of the Lord. It's always a blessing for you to continue to seek Him and, and for you to continue, continue to pour your faith and your trust in Him each and every day. It's always a blessing to always praise Him and lift His name up high for who He is and what He has done in your life. Isn't Jesus wonderful? Isn't He loving? Isn't he merciful? Isn't he the same today, yesterday, forevermore? Yes, he is. So don't he? So don't he deserve the praise? Don't he deserve the glory? Don't he deserve the honor? He deserve it all. Every day should be a day of praising your heavenly Father God. Hey, hallelujah. I don't know about you, but I love praising Jesus. I love lifting his name up high. I love glorifying his magnifying shine and his holy name for what he has done for me. If it wasn't for Jesus, glory, hallelujah, I want to be right, I want to be right here, right now today. If it wasn't for Jesus, where would you be at right now today? If it wasn't for Jesus that it got you out of that situation, where would you be at right now today, my brothers and my sisters? Don't he deserve the praise? Just don't praise him. Because you want something. Just don't praise him because you're going through something. You praise him. You praise him because he's your everything. You praise him because you love him. You praise him because you trust him. No matter what. You give him the thanks and praise and glory. Because our God is awesome. He is faithful. He is loving. And he is merciful. He is my everything. And I'm in love with Jesus. He is number one in my life. He comes before everything. He comes before my wife, my children, and my job. He is number one in my life. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Amen. And today's text is coming from Matthew chapter 8. And we're going to read verse 9. That's Matthew 8. And we're going to read verse 9. And today's message is Jesus have you under full authority right now jesus have you under full authority right now the enemy has been messed with somebody right now today the enemy has been messed with somebody's health someone's finances someone's children someone's relationship someone's marriage whatever it is that the enemy has been attacking you right now today jesus has sent his troops out right now for you and he have you under full authority right now this message today is clearly for someone today. I don't know who, but this message is clear for someone today. Amen? Amen. Before we get started, I always like to take the time out to give our Heavenly Father God all the thanks, all the praise, and all the glory. Oh, Heavenly Father God, this can't thank you enough for an awesome and beautiful, blessed day today. I can't thank you enough for another day of life today. I can't thank you enough for our strength today. I can't thank you enough for our healing today. I just can't thank you enough for our, our health today. I just can't thank you enough that we were able to get on our knees to pray to you even today. I just can't thank you enough that we was able to pour my faith and my trust in you even more today. I just can't thank you enough for your grace and your mercy. I just can't thank you enough because you're the same today, yesterday, and forevermore. I just can't thank you enough, Jesus. For what you have done. I just can't thank you enough, Jesus, for what you do in my life. I just can't thank you enough for the clothes and shoes that you put on my back. I just can't thank you enough for the food that you put on that table. I just can't thank you enough for the shelter that you provide for me and my family. I just can't thank you enough for the gift that you hand down in every last one of your children. I just can't thank you enough because you carry that, that our sins on your back. You pay the price for every last one of us, Jesus. And I just can't thank you enough. Is it one for you? We won't be right here today. Is it wasn't for you? Where would this world be? If it wasn't for you, Jesus. Hey, glory, hallelujah. I don't know about nobody else. But I just can't thank you enough, Jesus, for what you've done for me. I just can't thank you enough what you've done for my family. I just can't thank you enough. That can always call and depend and count on you. When everybody else turn their back against me, you never will. And I just can't thank you enough. I said, I just can't thank you enough, Jesus. I just can't thank you enough. In Jesus' holy mighty name. I just can't thank you enough. Amen. 
Amen. Now, my brothers and sisters, we about to get into this word. And I would love for y'all to turn your Bibles to Matthew 8. And we're going to read verse 9. That's Matthew chapter 8. And we're going to read verse 9. And if you have your Bibles open and ready to receive it, shout out amen. Amen. Let's begin. For I myself am a man under authority, with soldiers under me. Mm, glory. I tell this one, go, he comes. I say to my servant, do this, and he does it. For I myself am a man under authority, with soldiers under me. So right now, Jesus have soldiers up under him. And his soldiers right now are his angels right now. And his angels right now are ready for combat for his children right now. Because one thing about our God, our God know that we've been suffering way too long. Our God know that we've been going through some pain way too long. Our God know what we've been going through. He know what we've been facing right now. Our God know that the enemy has been trying to attack us and our finances. Our God know that the enemy has been trying to attack, attack us in our dreams. Our God know that the enemy has been trying to attack us through our children. Our God know that the enemy has been trying to attack us through our relationship. Our God know that the enemy trying to attack us through our marriage and right now we are sick and tired what the enemy is doing right now we are sick and tired how the enemy is still putting these stupid negative thoughts in our heads right now and today my brothers today my sisters jesus has us under full authority right now he has soldiers right now who's ready to protect us he has soldiers right now who's ready to go to war for us he has soldiers right now who's going to guard us 24 hours a day right now so i don't know who i'm talking to right now today i don't know who this message for today right now you are on a full authority right now so you can tell the devil say devil your time is up right now you have played with me way 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 long enough you have messed with my mind you have messed with my marriage way too long you have messed with my children you have messed with my finances you have messed with my head way too long but today my heavenly father God said he has soldiers up under him and this soldier that's under him right now they are going right now they are protecting me right now they are guarding me right now they are shielding me right now so no longer and no more that you will be able to mess with me and my family ever again we are under full authority right now right now my brothers right now my sisters you are under full authority right now you are under full authority on watch right now so you can sleep peacefully right now knowing that God has soldiers ready to protect you that God has soldiers ready to guard and shield you 24 hours per day each and every day in the mighty name of Jesus. And I don't know who I'm talking to today, but I know that this word, and I know that this message right now today is clearly for someone today. I know that the enemy has been messed with you way too long today, my sisters. I know that the enemy has been messed with you way too long today, my brothers. And I know you're tired. I know you're tired. Go and rebuke him right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Say, devil, your time is up. Say, devil, your time is up. No longer will you have your way anymore. No longer will you have your way in my marriage, in my relationship, in my finances, in my health, mess with my children, mess with my dreams, or put negative thoughts in my head. No longer. We're under new management right now. And that new management is Jesus. And Jesus has full authority over me. Jesus has full authority over my marriage. Jesus has full authority on my finances. Jesus has full authority over my children's life. Jesus has full authority on my health. Jesus has full authority on my dreams. Jesus has full authority over my household. Jesus has full authority over my vehicle. Jesus has full authority over my food. Jesus has full authority over my house. Jesus has full authority over my neighborhood. Jesus has full authority in my job. Right now, Jesus has full authority over us. Yes, he does. He has full authority right now. I'm tired of you, devil. I'm sick and tired of you. No longer will you think you're going to be getting away with your little shenanigans and your foolish acts. Today, today is it. It's over with right now in the mighty name of Jesus. I rebuke you. I rebuke you right now in the mighty name of Jesus. I'm under full authority right now. Tell yourself right now, my sisters. Tell yourself right now today, my brothers. Say, devil. See, this, this is I. And right now, today, 
I'm under full authority by Jesus. And Jesus has soldiers right now that's watching and protecting and guarding me right now. 24 hours a day because Jesus, who, my Jesus, has full authority over everything right now today. Yes, he does. He has full authority over you today, my sisters. He has full authority over you today, my brothers. Jesus has full authority. And if this word, this video, and this message is for you today, and, this is, and if it was helpful towards you today, let's give him thanks right now. Let's give him praise right now. Let's give him the glory right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Before I close, I would like to end with a prayer. Can you please pray with me? Lord Jesus, I ask of you to come into my life to guide us, direct us, use us, so we continue to build a relationship with you. And I believe right now in the mighty name of Jesus, by us praying that simple little prayer, that we already know that Jesus, that you already taking care of us right now today. And if you ever want to get in contact with me or leave me a comment, my YouTube channel is withers.lt. I love y'all. Y'all stay blessed. Continue yourself right now today. Say, brothers and sisters, make the devil mad right now. Say, devil, I'm under full authority right now. You are under full authority today. In Jesus' holy name, amen. Stay blessed.